Hello, I'm Andy and I'm going to read to you a weekly horoscope from the 18th of March to the 24th of March. And that's for you coming from Virgo. Sunday the 18th starts in a very aggressive way. It's all coming from your speech and your thoughts. And this aggressive approach is not good in the morning afternoon period. So take the soft approach, which simply means use words which are soft, a tone of voice which is soft, a body language which is soft, and you'll tame this couple of aggressive planets. They'll leave you alone, they'll surrender, and you'll be back into the happiest mode, all by taking the soft approach in every form. Accidents can happen, so slow down in your activity, of whether at home, whether on the road, whether anywhere. And be careful what you say throughout the whole day, because your words can become very blunt or very sarcastic. Evening nightfall becomes very, very lucky for you. But take the soft approach, because these aggressive planets don't leave you alone. They like to be in your evening nightfall as well. So take the soft approach. You are going to meet very lucky people. Some way or another, you're going to attract luck. So dress well, look well, communicate earlier part of the day, make plans to be out with the people who can help you, make full use of this. It's a kind of evening nightfall that just brings a reward, waiting to be rewarded one area of life or another. Be out and about, look your best and behave your best, be appreciative and supportive. And I'm sure you're going to be very lucky and be happy in this evening and nightfall period of Sunday the 18th. Monday the 19th, ego planets are there, not good for your place of work or in business, not good at all. And you don't want to be egoistic because nobody will want to come and support you. You'll get isolated. There are deadlines, there are important things, there are important uh, uh, plans to be done. It's a very important planet though and uh, makes things very important for you to achieve. And you need support. So rather than be arrogant, rather than wanting to be in the limelight, rather than wanting to take charge, do the opposite. Let others do all that. And you be the follower. And you'll be the nicest person on earth to show appreciation and support. And you will be able to handle morning, afternoon much better. Evening nightfall gets even worse. And so, you see, if mistakes are made morning, afternoon, they will creep into your evening nightfall. Or new problems can just erupt in the evening nightfall. Or all your plans of the evening nightfall can be cancelled or postponed. So double check all this. Morning, afternoon, worry about evening nightfall. What can go wrong? And whoever you are meeting evening nightfall, things can go wrong. Because these planets are very powerful. They can have their way. So what should you do? No arrogance. Let others take charge. Let others plan the evening nightfall period. Just be the follower. Say less, do less, show your best side, and you can turn this not good evening nightfall period into a bit betterness. Tuesday the 20th, many emotional planets are there. Morning, noon and night, there is trouble brewing in the air. Morning, afternoon, not so much. But still, emotional areas, you can miss your deadlines at work, mistakes can be created because you're not paying attention to your duties at work. In business, you can say the wrong thing, do the wrong thing. Emotions are riding you. Emotions are not good in your place of work or in business. Pull yourself back, repeat these words to yourself. Logic, facts and figures. Logic, facts and figures. And this will waken you up again and again at place of work or in business. Because you've got emotional planners making you think of emotional things, dreaming of emotions or suffering from emotions one way or another. It's about emotions taking away the concentration that you need at your place of work or in business. Yes, emotional bad news can come morning, afternoon. Not the worst of it, but it'll tend to make you a little bit lose energy. Evening nightfall really, really gets bad. Ooh. Accidents are possible. Now, these planets don't just appear suddenly evening, nightfall. They are there in the morning, afternoon, trying to get you from an emotional state to a reckless state, to somebody who gets blamed, to somebody who is not going to be supported. All that throughout the whole day. But it's the evening, nightfall that can get really, really bad. Accidents when you drive, accidents verbally, accidents physically, accidents emotionally, mentally, accidents are waiting to happen. Bad news comes, stay away from company who drinks too much or has bad habits. 
or you're going to be sucked into this problem in the evening nightfall period. And your reputation can also turn bad just by you being in the company of people whose reputation is not good. So tell yourself that if you don't have to be out evening nightfall, go back to the safety of your own home. Be with the people you love or be on your own. And hour by hour, let it pass and play safe. Once you, you see, horoscope is a plan and I'm reading to you a plan and you can change the plan by me telling you in advance what can happen. So evening nightfall, go home and be in the safety of your own home. Nothing really bad can come. You may get a phone call that troubles you a bit, makes you angry, but you are in the safety of your own home at least, not driving on the road where accidents are seen. Wednesday the 21st for you Virgo starts very well and is going to end pretty well. The thing is planets are going a bit slow. So go slow, be patient, hour by hour, morning, afternoon gets better and better. Your bosses, your superiors at work, the people you do business with, the people that you are in business with, all this can improve hour by hour. Expansion is in the air. You can hear very good news. Try not to dominate. That's the only thing I'll ask of you. Be flexible, be negotiable. There's a lot to gain in the morning, afternoon period. Good news comes. Evening, nightfall, also good. Same thing, planets are very slow. So plans may be postponed. You have to maybe wait for somebody to come who is late. Just patience. And also long-term planets always go slow in Virgo. So there's a long-term bonding possible, a long-term good news possible, a long-term meeting of somebody possible in this evening nightfall period. So go out, mix business and pleasure. You are going to be rewarded in the evening nightfall period, although a bit slowly. Thursday the 22nd, morning, afternoon, these planets now speed up. You have to be on your toes. Opportunities come left, right, center. What you say is very, very good. You say it in a genius kind of way because these planets make you impulsive in a good way. So you suddenly come up with ideas that are very brilliant morning, afternoon period at place of work or in business. So do that. Morning, afternoon, communicate, communicate, communicate. Email or phone calls or messages or whatever. What you say, people will really realize that you are a genius in your own way. Now, these fast planets can make you a little rebellious. So try not to do that. People who are a genius are normally rebellious. So you'll try to get into a state where others won't understand what you're saying anymore. So pull yourself back and tell yourself, keep within boundaries. There is an aggressive planet also there in the morning, afternoon, who might make your approach very aggressive. Sometimes it means over-determined in what you want, chasing for what you want in an over-determined way. People don't like that. Like if you are chasing for a romance and you are going again and again against it. Be patient and you will get your morning, afternoon that way. Evening nightfall is all about the aggressive, aggressive planets and the fast planets. So they make you want everything instant. And when that doesn't happen, you get aggressive and you get over-determined again. Chasing for that, stepping on toes, you don't care. You want your way. Control these over-determined planets. Tell yourself, let me go for a 50% stake and I'll be happy enough. That way you'll do better in the evening nightfall session and use words which are soft and a tone of voice which is soft and a body language which is soft in the evening nightfall session. Don't show aggressiveness. Friday the 23rd is a brilliant morning and afternoon period. You can meet important people. You will say important good things at place of work or in business. There's so much opportunity everywhere that you look. So communicate, ask favors in every fashion that you can. And you will see you get more than a handful, more than a fistful of good luck coming your way. It's all up to you. I want you to narrow down and focus on what's the most important that you want, morning, afternoon periods. Is it chasing the romance? Is it talking to your bosses? Is it in the business area? And you will get that coming your way and under control. You have an aura which is very strong. But this aura can show arrogance as well, wanting your way because you're so sure of yourself. Well, be flexible and that way you will improve your morning-afternoon period. 
evening nightfall plenty of ego planets are there while you're enjoying your success i suppose from the morning and afternoon and evening nightfall the ego planets there and wanting you to take charge have things done your way where to eat where to go what to do <laughs> try not to do that because these ego planets on their own are not stable and so don't let them take charge get your you're going to meet business people you can meet people you work with you can find solutions a lot in the evening nightfall and make some great contacts as well and romance is all there for the whole day just don't show arrogance be flexible let's go to saturday the 24th that doesn't start oh that starts terribly for you saturday the 24th morning afternoon period is no good things go wrong very fast you are in a frame of mind looking for trouble yourself emotional planets are also there whether with family whether with romance whether with marriage whether with people you work with or you do business with whoever you are with that yourself trouble can erupt very quickly so if you have to be out with all these people or any of these people tell yourself say less do less be logical don't let emotions creep in and you will be able to do much better in the morning afternoon you can't disappear things life goes on so be the way that i've just described you should be and you'll be all right evening nightfall too much water in the horoscope when there's too much water for you in virgo you change your mind you are undecided you are over emotional you are over sensitive so it's all to do with the emotional areas in the evening nightfall and that's when the emotions are best off in during the evening nightfall so don't argue firstly and don't want to take charge and you'll get your evening nightfall much better off in the saturday of 24th well i'm already skyping and i'm charging usd 550 for a 90 minute skype session during this 90 minutes i'll tackle your next 7 or 8 years in all areas of your life and i'll do that by having your date of birth and your time of birth and looking at your palms and face reading you while we skype as well so go to facebook go to skype leave me a message send me an email Let's get down to making your next seven or eight years to be brought under your control by knowing what's going to be happening. Until then, thank you and good luck.